It's the top of everybody's agenda at the moment, the, the, the whole income reduction thing and indeed the right to buy agenda as well. Um, I think AT Dominion is already in a position where we're delivering services very efficiently through the use of the JV. Um, and the JV we can look to extend out to additional areas of our service delivery model um, through, through procurement that potentially can give us more savings and, and make that delivery all, 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 all the better and all the sharper. I think we're seeing it's a real sea change for the sector um, and I think the sector is, is going to shape up for the challenge and um, will be looking at innovative delivery models such as our subsidiary model um, as ways to actually help them to drive greater efficiency in their business whilst maintaining or improving service quality um, and service performance improvements. So I think we're going to see a greater interest in alternative delivery models. It potentially could change um, the face of social housing in and around some of the inner city, primarily the London um, authorities. And I think social housing in the next few years will look completely different uh, from what it has done in the past. importantly being able to establish a shared vision and a cultural alignment that enables us to bring that additionality and social value but also in terms of service quality and drivers for service improvement. Um, so for example um, our annual stakeholder days where everyone involved in the partnership comes together um, to identify our service improvement priorities for the forthcoming year and those are around improving service, improving quality, improving processes, driving cost efficiency. I felt that that was inefficient and would be um, more beneficial if we could actually consolidate some of those in terms of a one large contract. Alongside that, we also identify that the repairs have a direct impact in terms of the capital investment and if you had a partner that could actually identify where there was a, a longer term maintenance implication rather than keep doing the standard day to day repairs, then you feed that through a strategic asset management approach into delivering a capital program which then hopefully would re, you know, sort of keep your repairs budget under control on an annual basis so it's working in that sort of partnership and then further direct the capital monies that you had available into specific areas and again it's using the skills and abilities from the partner uh, and their knowledge through other contracts that they actually um, undertake to be able to deliver that service for us on a, on a, on a much more um, joined up approach really. We recently got won an award around innovation um, at St Winifred's um, in conjunction with Mighty, which again shows the strength of our partnership and, um, and that use of innovation to, to deliver good solutions for, for a particular scheme that hopefully will see benefit for the, for the residents and give us better value as well. What we've been able to deliver through our model and in partnership with Mighty is um, substantially more than the traditional employment and skills plan that you have within a maintenance contract of this type. Since we've been working with Mighty, there has been a much more um, focused approach in terms of how we get the benefits out of the, the other partnership arrangements that Mighty have access to. And one of those key areas is the company Utilix because the, as a council we are currently looking at a housing energy strategy in terms of how we can bring new technology, new innovation uh, into the services that we provide. So alongside the day-to-day -day traditional repairs and maintenance and planned investment, we want to be innovative. So we're looking to use some of those other partners that are already working with Mighty elsewhere in the country um, to the fore and, and then going to be taking that through cabinet to hopefully get a decision taken that we can start bringing those on to the benefit of the customers again.